welcome to the school management system let us continue okay so first we are going to create the classes they have given us this so we can redeem it okay so first let's click here and click here to rename it so, so let's say uh, the first class is nursery nursery one as one okay in some of the schools we have a b c okay so if it is nursery one a just leave it as nursery one okay we will come to that i'll show you how you can make it a and b and c and the rest let me click the class again you see it has been saved here let's go so let me make this one j or basic seven basic seven basic eight okay basic eight that is ghs okay yeah and then let's go that back so i can now rename this one and make it uh basic seven so this one will be basic seven And here the last one I'm using JHS so JHS 1 2 and 3 and here will be basic 8 basic 9 sorry basic 9 okay so let me come back here so I'm done with the classes uh if you if you don't need the rest you have to delete it okay so just click here and delete that okay so delete the rest i'll pause the video and complete it okay so we are done okay we have added the three classes if you your i mean your school the classes are from primary to ghs you can add all of them but this is what i have in case you have deleted all of them but you want to add extra classes or extra class you can click here and do that but let's go to sessions what are we going to do session is whereby we are looking at either um the vacation date and so and so forth okay uh, that's what about the session so we can go with let's say when you click here um yes here and the session name term one Term one okay so we can now enter the starting date 2023 january 10th then we will vacate on what day the same 2023 2023 april i don't remember the date but let's go with um, 14th so that is the for the first time good so let's select the session again then we have second term starting date uh, term 2 that's the name the same we vacate on the same we will re reopen on the same um april let's say a week later so 21st and we will vacate on the same year month july um let's say july mm, 15th let me update it so we are done with the second term third term so we can now click here and add a tab so third tab tab 3 the date the same year okay i guess mm, 20 something so just use i'm just 
I'm sh uh, I just want to guide you on how to go about it, okay? The same year, and this time is September. <laughs> uh, okay, so let's say this date, that's the day that we will vacate on Tetem. Okay, good. So we are done with that, okay? So when you go to sessions again, uh, we will see all the list of sessions, but you have to select the default one. I think, okay, we won't do it here. So let's go to settings. Okay, the settings here. Uh, we will do that later. I will show you what to do later, so don't worry. Uh, let's go back to school. And I think the term, no, we have added a term, but we have to select the default term. Okay, let's see if uh, we have to make that change here. Let's see. I think it's not here. So let's go down here. Let's go to SM school. Okay, so we are done with here and here. Okay, so now let's go here and I think we are done with that part too. That's where we added. Okay, so now in case if you want to add assign a class, um, we can also do it here. So we are done with adding the classes. We're now going to assign a class. So click here, assign class. Good. So we have added a class, but we have not assigned a class. So we are now going to do that. So we can select all and it will check all the all of them. Okay. So after that, you can now view the class. Sorry. Okay. We have selected it. So you have to. Oh, come on I think let's do it again assign a class to this school we assign a class to the school okay so select all let's click here and assign to be added here good so you see it's, it has been added good and we are done with that okay and let's go to let's go here so let's go to the dashboard again so as you can see total classes sessions sessions two is three so we have to work on that okay we have to change the sessions okay um we will come to that okay here let's go here and here let's go to class sessions okay now I'm going to show you what we can do over here. So the class session here we are looking at in case basic seven we have A B C. Okay, we have A B C it is where we have to do that. So you click manage, then uh they have given us A already, so then the B okay, so then click add if the class is from A to C then you can also add C then you add it so as you can see we have the third class for now so we can now click class again class session and now as you can see basic 7 we have added three classes A B C so you can do the rest okay good now uh, we will end here thank you for watching our next video we will look at how to add a subject the timetable and so and so forth. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.